You are now listening to Vigilantes Radio, presented by the only one media group. This is the people's choice for quality interviews, celebrities, and special guests. Hosted by Demetrius Dinny Reynolds. Call in to join the mix at 701-801-9813. For the complete archive of episodes, visit onlyonemediagroup.com and be sure to like us on Facebook at Vigilantes Radio. We welcome all. Enjoy the show. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome your host, Demetrius Houdini Black Reynolds. Enjoy the show. At dollarseed.com, all of our seeds are only a dollar a pack. And we have online resources that teach you all about the rewarding hobby of growing your own plants, flowers, herbs, and vegetables. Imagine the joy you'll feel when your children actually help you harvest your first garden crop. Or the pride of knowing you'll never need a florist again. Visit dollarseed.com and grow a little magic of your own for just a dollar. dollarseed.com. What could be healthier? Hello, hello, hello. What is going on, guys? Welcome to another incredible episode of Vigilantes Radio Live right here on iHeartRadio. And I'm your host, Dini. We have another special guest for you guys, so you definitely want to stick around for that. And as a matter of fact, uh, text your buddies or your family members or even share it on social media right now. And let them know that we are about to dive deep into another interview. Before I bring my guest on, I do want to say, well, rather ask, can you feel it? And what I mean by that today, well, today's almost over, so let's go with tomorrow. It's going to be an absolutely great day. Can you feel that? Can you believe it? You say, Dini, well, what's going to make it such a great day? Well, my friend, uh, you are, you know, quick. Look around you and think of three things. Right, right now, three things for which you can be sincerely thankful for. I know, I know, we complain a lot. Well, I'm not saying you. Maybe it's just me that complain a lot. I don't complain too much, but sometimes I catch myself. And then I have to stop myself and say, "Hey, man, you're you're not that uh, you're not that uh, you're not you're not doing so bad, bro. Look around you. Everything is great. It's like ah yeah yeah because it can be so much worse, right? For sure. So that was easy, right? Wasn't it? In an instant, you were able to change the tone of anything and make it positive by thinking about what you have going on rather than what's going wrong. Now, build on that gratitude. There are good and valuable things in your life right now. And today is an opportunity, is your opportunity to create even more. Can you see that opportunity? is right in front of you. Allow yourself to dream for a moment. If you had the power to make your life exactly the way you want it, it to be if you could have or or be or do literally anything what would that be imagine how great it would be imagine how great it would feel keep on imagining it keep on feeling it and every moment will turn into an opportunity to really tr- truly make it happen i know you've heard the saying fake it until you make it well the part about the faking it till you make it is that you have to keep doing something until it clicks until it turns on Let's not, let's take the word faking out of it. Let's just say, continue to work towards your goal until you make it. That's all I'm saying, man. You can dress it up however you want it. I'm no judge. I'm just saying. The fact is, you do have the power to make your life into the very best thing that you can imagine. So dare to imagine, dare to dream. And the more intensely and the more positively you can imagine great things for yourself and your world, the more surely and quickly you'll have things happen by the life that you live in every moment of this beautiful, absolutely 
fabulous day. Take that from me, Coach Dini. That is my word and word is... Have you struggled budgeting your finances? Don't worry, you're not alone. HumbledBudget.com. That's H-U-M-B-L-E-D-B-U-D-G-E-T.com is the help and resource you've been searching for. HumbledBudget.com is a personal finance and educational website with a great variety of topics when it comes to budgeting, taxes, investing, and the popular topic of FIRE, financial independence, retire early. HumbledBudget.com has a goal, and that's to help you reach your financial dreams, no matter what your goals are when it comes to finances. It doesn't matter where you start, where you come from, or where you are right now. HumbledBudget.com can help. What are you waiting for? Take that first step to the financial life you've dreamed of and go to HumbledBudget.com. That's H-U-M-B-L-E-D-B-U-D-G-E-T. HumbledBudget.com. Again, welcome to the show. You're listening to VRL. That's Vigilantes Radio. And I'm your host, Dini. Our interviews are designed to go beyond music, news, books, art, acting, films, technology, education, entrepreneurship, entertainment and sometimes even past that thing that we call the ego our interviews are designed to go behind the scenes and into the minds of these incredible human beings you know the ones who were out there giving it their all for me and for you and for the world today joining us is Thule a trailblazing rapper and the driving force behind Dungeon Records with roots in Jacksonville's underground hip hop and influences from Baltimore's club scenes Thule is redefining the game. So I want you guys to yeah, text your buddy, share it on social media, tell a neighbor or two to tune in for this exclusive deep dive with Thule, rapper extraordinaire and co-founder of Dungeon Records. As I said, he's from Jacksonville, but he's he has the vibes of Baltimore and discovered the story behind his hit single Worth It and his vision for Dungeon Records. Experience a journey of self-worth, inspiration, and an undying passion for hip-hop. And with that, let's welcome him to the show. Yo, 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 what is up? What they do, man? What's up, man? I love the intro. Hey, man, I appreciate that. How are you doing? I'm all right, you know, just, just hanging in there. For sure, for sure, man. Uh, before we kick things off, before we discover your whys and your hows, we want to know about the who. So tell it to us, man. How did you discover your passion for creating music? So yeah, yeah. Um, you know, I was, you know, about five years old, man. I can remember it like I was yesterday, like it was yesterday for where, you know, I just, I woke up from a nap, you know, and my brother in the living room playing 50 Cent on, I think it was Wankster. You know, playing that on 106 and Park, you know, exclusive music video. And I just woke up, and that was the first thing I saw. And, like, you know, I was never, I was mesmerized for real. Like, I just couldn't believe what I was seeing, you know, in his story. So that was the first album I bought. And, like, ever since then, like, that's what inspired me to make music. It was, you know, really simply set in his story for real. Yeah. Man, that's what's up. What do you think about 50 Nowadays? Man, I look at him as, like, really paving the way. I see so many artists, like, coming up in the game, like, really giving him his flowers, like, from the baby to, you know, so many artists, like, giving him, you know, his recognition that he deserves, like, <clears throat> paving the way for everybody, like, to come up in this hip-hop, you know, industry and, you know, make a name for themselves beyond, you know, just rapping, like, you know, I remember when he did Vitamin Water, like, you know what I'm saying? So yeah. it's just so many avenues that he showed that, you know, that that's that's capable for, you know, young African Americans who go through so many trials and tribulations, you know. Absolutely. So man, um, uh, can you shed a shed light on the moment that propelled your belief in self worth? Uh <clears throat> I mean I probably you know, I, I had like many you know, instances, but the one that really, really stood out for real is my mom losing the house, you know, in 2017, like, that really showed me, like, you know, I need to, I need to take heed in that and, like, really make sure that that never happens again to none of my family members, you know, so, 
Mm. I feel like around that time, you know, I experienced that with her, me and her, you know, when people came, you know, it was time to go. So, yeah, once that happened, like, I was like, man, this is, you know, I got to be, be somebody, you know? So. Yeah. Did you, did you take to the grind instantly or did it take a while to, you know, to kind of get your foot? <clears throat> I mean, being a younger, you know, just being young in general, um, definitely took some time. I was able to grow into it. You know, I just graduated with my bachelor's in um, business administration. Just started my business, you know, officially last year. So, I mean, I feel like, you know, definitely I've been taking steps and all. Uh, them steps definitely paid off. So I'm working, man. I'm getting there, you know, you know, trying to look at every avenue, you know, coming from, you know, just trying to make it for real. Man, that's all it that's all that matters, man. It's to try. So so now worth it. That's a powerful title. Well before I get into yeah. that, what made self worth a central theme in your music. I know you you got it in your head that hey, this doesn't need to happen. You're on your entrepreneur thing. You're on your school thing. You know you, you're you're improving as a human being. But what about the music side? When did it become your main banner or your main theme? Man, really, I you know me and me and my homies like from back in Jacksonville and shit, Duval County. You know, definitely got a salute. But me and my dogs, for real, since growing up, you know, we was in my mama house, you know, doing music. Like, I, I showed them the way, like, you know, just with music in general. You, you feel me? Just having an outlet. So, around that time, just growing up, you know, back back around the way, for real, just growing up, you know, and then my dog catching years and shit. I mean, oh, excuse me for my language. No, you can my catch people, you know, <laughs> my people, you feel me, catching years, for real. In the system, you know, we, we, we worth more than that. You know what I'm saying? Like, they show us every day when it comes to numbers on Bloomberg. You know, just, just in general, like, we really put money in, in, into the world for real. Like, we really stand out. So, like, we as African Americans in the community and for the culture, like, we really put on. So, we really worth it. Like, we got to recognize that in our eyes. Like, they already recognize we just got to, you feel me, recognize that and, like, understand. So just from the experiences, man, like, I don't want to see none of my people struggle and have to risk their lives. You know what I'm saying? I want them to risk their minds and put their minds to work and come up with solutions to, you feel me, take take their people out of their situation so that to never happen again. Like, generational wealth is, is really where my mind is. Yes, sir. That part, man. I love it. I love it. Um, so back to the title worth it that's a powerful title um how does this song reflect to your personal journey and experiences man for real just everything you know what i said just wrapping it up for real just just basically just going through life every day as a you know as a young african-american male just in, in america like just going through life man just trying to figure it out like I had plenty of examples, you know, placed in front of me, so I made sure, like, they wrongs I don't do and they rights, you know, I take notes and, you know, take heed. So, really, man, just, yeah, just, just my just my walk, man, in general, for real, just the things I've been through, everything I talked about, my, my people, you feel me, my mom, just everything, man, growing up with me and my brother, like, music is really, really my passion, really what I love, and, like, when it comes to music, like, Everything I do, man, it's worth it. It's worth it at the end of the day. Yes, sir. Man, uh, tell us about 50 Cent and, and how he shaped your approach to hip-hop. Yeah, just his story, man. Like, everybody knows his story. He had shot nine times, like, especially as, you know, as a young, like, just, just young and growing up, like, you know, five years old, just hearing that, you know, just... It's action-packed, man, and it's just real life because I really, you know, didn't think I was going to make it to see 18, you know what I'm saying? I'm 27 mm-hmm. now, like, so I really thought that, you know, growing up, even at five years old, so I don't know if it was because of TV I watched or the music I listened to, but, man, I really, you know, just what I experienced at the end of the day, like, I really thought that in my head, so, you know, to hear him, like, succumb to them, you know, them conditions and, survive and make a whole career out of it 
It's just I know I can do it at the end of the day, and for real, that's what that's what inspires me every day. For real, just yes, just sure. trying to change people's lives. Absolutely, man. That that just tells about the power in music. Um, and when it comes to your own music, how do how does it make you feel when you listen to it? Man, I really been steering away, like just just trying to be positive and like you know just just shed light on on what we're capable of. For real, that's really what my music been been gearing towards. You know, like I say, I was I was young, you know. My music speaks for itself, you know. Of course, I'm a, I'm a talk how I talk, but at the end of the day, I'm really just trying to share light, man. And like, I know people know this. They got phones. They be on, they be on Twitter. They be on TikTok. They see all these videos, but it's like, what we really gonna do about it? You know, and me rapping, it just makes me. You feel me? It's a message to myself. Like, at the end of the day, it's a message to the people and to myself because I'm still. I'm still a work in progress. You know mm. what I'm saying? So, so yeah, that's just what it is, man. At the end of the day, man, just just trying to do better for real. I'm like, that's just how I express myself. You know, I'm I don't really talk to myself, but that's that's another way to talk to myself and remind myself like what it's all about and what I'm doing it for. Yeah, absolutely, I believe that too, man. All right, we're about to jump into the single Worth It, and then we'll be back to put Thule in our traditional hot seat to where he gets to perform for us, whether that's rapping, freestyle, poetry, spoken word, singing, playing an instrument, uh, telling a joke, telling a story from his life, or just giving some advice. But for right now, guys, here it is, Worth It. Stay tuned. Let me tell you something you already know. The world ain't all sunshine and rainbows. It's a very mean nasty place and I don't care how tough you are it will beat you to your knees and keep you there permanently if you let it you me or nobody is gonna hit as hard as life but it ain't about how hard you hit it's about how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward how much you can take and keep moving forward that's how winning is done totally Ain't gon' argue with no bitch, it ain't even worth it. Pullin' all nighters cause they all need my service. I was worthless until I put that work in. Now she feel like a nigga, oh ass a Birkin. I put heart and soul in this shit, they put no perks in. Poppin' two by two, now that's a different person. Streets a pretty place when you come up to that surface. Just keep back the normal, don't look nervous. Keep it on me just in case of a disturbance. Miscommunication, you can miss me with that word shit. Nothing to discuss if it's a fuss, then it's murder. Sleeping like a baby, waking up next to my burn. In that doolet truck, refuse to hit that toilet bus. Shots ringing, I think twice before you try your luck. Niggas don't know who to bust, same shit by who to trust. Niggas ain't gonna be satisfied until they back the dust. Ain't nobody tell me nothing. Streets just had to show me some. Forced to get it out the mud. No, I ain't the only one, but I'll be the chosen one. Get my people out the slums, know that they don't owe me one. Fuck around and Kobe some. Trinity, the global sun, look alive, looking young, ain't no damn prodigy, know my mama proud of me, I am who I'm supposed to be, niggas can't get close to me, so ain't no fucking over me, ain't gon' think about no lick, it ain't even worth it, pulling all nighters cause they all need my service, I was worthless until I put that work in, now she feel like a nigga, oh ass a Birkin, ain't gon' argue with no bitch, it ain't even worth it. Pulling all nighters cause they all need my service. I was worthless until I put that work in. Now she feel like a nigga, oh ass a burk. Putting food on the table, making sure I got a purpose. Filling up purses, there's nothing I concerned with. More like I got missions. Filling up prescriptions, married into medicine. Money be my fitness. Running to that check, call me million dollar listing. All my clientele got me working for a living. Money on my mind, got ingredients to mix with. Label me a miss. Got me on my tip shit Ain't no sideways capping Don't be on no bitch shit Talking out the side of your neck Throwing the bitch fit I just hit the kill switch Ain't nothing to deal with Chasing out my dreams I've been stuck in tunnel vision Ain't gonna think about no lick It ain't even worth it Pulling all nighters Cause they all need my service I was worthless Until I put that work in Now she feel like a nigga Oh ass a Birkin Ain't gonna argue with no bitch It ain't even worth it Pulling all nighters cause they all need my service I was worthless until I put that work in Now she feel like a nigga, oh ass a Birkin Excuse me Alright, alright, guys
guys welcome back again that was worth it by Thule man that is a lesson for you youngins out there listen 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 you ever had an argument you know with your significant other or with someone no, I can't say that I get canceled all right let's just stick with that significant other all right yeah yeah so well we'll let Thule tell us Yo, 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 welcome back, man. So, what I was getting at, do you have any stories about arguments with exes that kind of went wrong? Man, hey, look. (laughs) Don't put me on the spot now. What, this the hot seat right here? Hold up. (laughs) Oh, hold up. Nah, nah, I really... Nah, man, not really, you feel me? Everything, you know... I just, I just play it cool for real. I'm a really friendly guy, you know. I got my fiance, so I can't really, really think about any anything with no exes, you know. <laughs> okay, okay. What you boy. was about to say? Though, I wanted to hear what you was gonna say. Cause you said you couldn't say that. What you was gonna say? Right. Well, see, I'm gonna follow in your footsteps because you're a genius. So, I'm, I'm a likewise, and uh, I'm a genius too. So yeah, man, I, I can't even think that far back, really. Yeah, man. I mean, that that song was made a while back ago. You know what I'm saying? It was really just you feel me, just just the message. You know what I'm saying? Like it just really ain't worth it. You know what I'm saying? Like it, it's really not worth it. Don't put yourself in harm's way. Don't 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 trip too much. You know, it just ain't worth it. You feel me? <laughs> but yeah, man, that that song is absolutely right, though, man. Like, how many arguments went south just because hurt people hurt people? For real, man. Look. It was just an incident, man, R.I.P., man, to the, to the old man who just lost his life at a football game, man. Like, that, sh- that, that, sh- that shouldn't be going on. You know what I'm saying? Like, I think it was with Miami Dolphins and um, somebody else. I forgot the other team. I think it was New England Patriots, man. Somebody. But, yeah, some fan lost his life, man, from a one-hit punch. Like, it ain't worth it, man. Now, now two families are going through it. Like, yeah. it just ain't worth it, man. Absolutely, man. All right, all right. Um, so the lead single "Need a Check" uh, features Canon MBS. Tell us about the collaboration. How did it come about? Yeah, man, that's my dog, Canon MBS, man. Yeah, straight from Delaware, Wilmington. So, so yeah, man, that's my dog for real. That's one of my artists. I don't even like to say artists for real because we we all building each other, but. You know, I got my own record label, and that, that's one of my artists who, who currently with us, um, dropping dropping bangers. You feel me? And that's one of our lead singles on um, my my next on um, album. Everybody hates Chris coming coming to stores, all the streaming platforms. But yeah, that that's the lead single from that. And you know, just he, he really putting it down, man. Put putting it on for Wilmington. You know. I don't know if people know this, but Suki Hana, she from Wilmington, Delaware. You feel me? And bro put me on. And like, ever since we just collabed, man, ever since we connected, it's just been love straight from the beginning. Like, he passionate just as, just as much as I'm passionate about his music journey. So, like, everything that we do, man, we, we doing it for each other. We doing it for the culture. And we just, we just trying to put on, man, for real. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Man, where can our listeners connect with you online? Yeah, go follow me on Instagram, Tooley2900. That's Tooley2900, T-U-L-L-E-2900. Um, you can go subscribe to my YouTube channel. Same thing, T-U-L-L-E-2900. TikTok, same thing. You know, I'm I'm on all the streaming platforms, the major streaming platforms, Audio Mac, Deezer, Apple Music, Spotify, Tidal, whatever. Just type in Tooley. Need a check or type in Tooley Worth It. That's the latest single that we pushing. Need a check. We got a music video for that. Worth It. I just dropped the official music video. Go subscribe to my YouTube. Get all the latest from Dungeon Records and Tooley. And you'll see, man, what all our artists got going on. We got like four artists and we, we pushing, man. So just stay tuned. All right, all right. And speaking of that, man, congratulations on Dungeon Records co founding that. That's a big step. Um, but uh, with the with the current landslide in the industry, what's the driving force behind this label 
especially when you have all these gurus online telling artists that they don't even need a label. Man, look, man. You just, if you really in tune with it, you definitely watch the the exclusive interview with Yo Gotti on um on um ah, I'm sorry, I had to forgive him. Dang, what what earn your leisure. I'm sorry, y'all. You know I be tuned in. Earn your leisure. I know you had to really see it if you really in tune with it, but Yo Gotti broke it down, man. Like it ain't nothing wrong with signing three hundred and sixty. I'm looking to sign with a record label. You feel me? Just a partnership deal. Just to you feel me? Fuel my record label. But ain't nothing wrong with signing with a deal. So don't let them get in your head saying you know it's it's bad to sign a deal. Ain't nothing wrong with it, man. If it's gonna change your family's lives, if you if you smart, if you frugal with your money, you know what I'm saying? It might be a bad time. But if you smart. You make, you know, sound financial investments and you, you do what you're supposed to do and you surround yourself with the right people, it'll work out, man. Like, it, it's money to be made, man. So these labels ain't stingy. They just, they think we dumb. And we're not dumb, man. We we, we we smart. So we just got to use that to our advantage and, and excel. Yes, sir. Man, I second that. Man, that was a good answer. Um, just to add to that, artists man just just do what you feel is right a lot of people will have advice for you some take what you can out of it and leave the rest to the side and no shade to those gurus but most of them guys are not even working in the industry they're just looking at numbers and data you know real talk real Real talk talk, man don't let that fuel your head man do what you you see you feel you feel best and make your move, man, your next best move. That's that's all it is too. Absolutely. If you leap, you may discover that you have wings. All right, Tuli. Yeah. Thank you so much, brother, for joining us tonight and spending some time with us. We really appreciate you. Mandatory, man. Shout out um yeah, shout out to y'all, man. You already know me. Absolutely. All right, man. Take care. Have a great night. Yes, sir, you too. Thank you. Peace. Are you ready? Listen up, I'm about to help you become a legend. Do you live in Pennsylvania and want to become a professional wrestler? Are you willing to put in the work but only find schools that want to rip you off? If you want to be a star, you need trainers who have experience and genuinely care about your success. And that's why the Stronghold Wrestling Academy is the only school for you. The Stronghold Wrestling Academy features a full gym and trainers with almost 100 years experience between them. Learn every aspect of the wrestling business, from the art of promos to crafting your persona. And most importantly, learn to wrestle like a pro. The Stronghold Wrestling Academy has graduates who've signed with Impact Wrestling, AEW, and even the WWE. Could you be next? For more information on our open house and upcoming classes, go to risewrestling.com and select train. That's R-Y-S-E wrestling.com and select train. Remember, half the battle is believing you have what it takes. The other half is why you have us. The Stronghold Wrestling Academy. Thank you, my Vigilantes family, as always, for checking out my podcast over here at Vigilantes Radio Live. All episodes are available for free download, and you can grab it from either Spricker.com forward slash only one media group, Spotify, Castbox, iHeart Radio, iTunes, YouTube, the app Podcast Addict, or over at our website which again is only one media group.com and that goes for every single show that we've ever aired if you like to request some music or send something for me to play email it to v radio at only one media group.com that is v as in victor and here's my disclaimer we are genre free we do not judge and we absolutely do not base our opinions on hearsay but facts alone And actually, scratch all of that because all of my opinions are always right. That's the bottom line. This is my show, so deal with it. (laughs) Just kidding. On behalf of myself, Denny, I appreciate all you guys for tuning in, either afterwards or live with us. Spread the word because sharing is caring. We stepped up our game just for you guys and our guests to make sure that you have the best experience here on our show. Be sure to connect with me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Tumblr, Snapchat, TikTok, at all social media sites, as well as Spreaker, 
YouTube, we always follow back. Okay, well, just remember to put yourself into everything that you do and never stop investing in yourself. Peace, love, grilled cheese, and talk with you later. You are now listening to Vigilantes Radio, the people's choice for quality interviews, art, music, and hot topics. Hosted by Demetrius Houdini Black Reynolds of the duo No Longer The Hero. All episodes of this podcast are available for free download at www.onlyonemediagroup.com. This is a 7th Sign Regime Rebirth Worldwide Syndicate Exclusive.